Victorious. Mutt like that. Yeah, but how do you explain his chain being cut, huh? Tori, ass, listen to me. I heard that aliens from outer space come to Earth sometimes. You know, like the ones that chop up cows and take people away in flying saucers. They're real quiet and they only come at night so nobody sees them. They sneak up and then they beam you to their ship. You see, it's aliens. That's what happened to Papa Doll. Tori, ass, do uh, you hear Miko! Uh, uh? Will you please quit calling me by that name? All right. But everyone calls you Torias. Well, I'm your big brother. You should huh? refer to me as Yasuo. Yasuo? It's not as catchy. But if that's the way you want it, then come on, Yasuo! <laughs> the Notions probably stole Papa Doll so they can experiment on him. I feel sorry for the poor thing. There's no life on Venus. Uh, Martians took him! Yeah, nice try, but I'm afraid there's no life on Mars either. UFOs, aliens, crop circles, it's all a bunch of bunk. You can't believe in that kind of silly stuff, Miko. If you do, you're just gonna regret it. Uh-uh, no, I won't. <laughs> Don't be so sure they're not real, cause maybe, just maybe they uh, are. Or maybe, just maybe, you're a gullible dork. Uh, the only weird life forms that are gonna stop by our place are the gas man, the newspaper boy, and people like that. Besides, he hasn't wanted to go on a walk for a long time. Lately, the lazy mongrel won't even answer to his name when I call. Oh, and please, be smart. Don't babble about aliens at school. Uh, uh. Miko, I warned you. When the others make fun of you, you'll be sorry. Look at this. It says Papa Doll. We found it. All right, let's hurry. 9,600 balls have already passed. Now grab the chain, oi oi. The chain. Right oh, right oh. Here we are. <laughs> Keep it.
Keep alert. Huh? Hey, is this the owner? Yeah, look. Ah. That's Papa Doll's goofy face. My. They really transform, don't they? Are you sure it's him? I'm sure. Get the Tomcat. One Tomcat. <laughs> Some help! I'm smelling Papa Door sand everywhere. Who cares? Grab that end. On the count of three, we'll lift him up. One, two, three. Come on! Why don't we wake him by just scratching his face? Because we can't have him screaming before he gets in the Tomcat. Huh? Stop hollering. Don't go. He's awake. Don't be scared. We're not bad cats. We won't hurt you. <clears throat> we are felines who have traveled from afar to find the owner of Papa Doll. It's important that you come with us. Uh, no! Oh! So you're the ones. You're the space aliens who abducted our family pet. Uh, no, no, we're not space aliens. We're ordinary cats. You're a great big bigger. Now tell me where you came from. Venus, Mars, or the planet? Please, keep it down! He might get moody and there's no telling what one of these things will do. Uh oh Blasted boy! Come on, wake up! Bratty animals! I remember you now! I saw you in town snooping around in an alley this morning. Are you implying that we're nothing more than a bunch of prowling alley cats? Hey, calm down! Huh? What's the matter? Forget what Papa Doll looks like? He's the pooch you ran off with to the Planet of Cats! Huh! Planet of Cats? Ridiculous! Hoi hoi, help us out! You mean this time you're here to kidnap my brother? We're not kidnappers. We simply want the boy to accompany us. <laughs> Don't quiet. My lazy brother is not an easy person to wake up. Watch this. Sutoboke, the girl believes that she's coming with us. You have to tell her that we only want the boy. But, but Hennessy, she seems so happy about it. Look at her. Mm, no, I think I'll wear my special hat. Good. <laughs> Don't you realize that if we bring one more human, we'll make an even louder ruckus and risk being caught? Uh -huh. Thanks, huh? Tutorius. My brother doesn't believe in space aliens like me, although I'm surprised there's a cat planet. I'm not afraid to go because you guys seem nice. Um, listen, I don't want to burst your bubble, but this really isn't the place for you. And besides, it's very late. Little human girls ought to be asleep in their beds getting plenty of rest. No way! Why should I stay behind while Torius has all the fun? That's not uh, fair! Uh, I am going! Ah! Uh, please be quiet or some adults might hear you! I want to go too! If you don't take me, I'm gonna scream louder. Energy, no, no, it's here. Huh? Well, of course. <laughs> Are you finding this funny? <laughs> this wasn't the plan! No? Can't be late for school, just gotta go. You won't be needing this!
ride will get rough a bit. Hold on tight. The air pressure is A-OK, -okay, Energy. Good, then set a course for Bonneville Wit. Right on. that leads directly to East Cast Bonapol Wit. Bonapol who? Oh, that's your planet, oh, right? Well, no, it's not exactly a planet. But... Ah! Ah! Oh, betcha that's smart. Don't buy into this, Miko! These goons are really kidnappers just pretending to be cats. They're using makeup and special effects. Hey, come on, show us who you are! Energy, perhaps we should explain things to them now. The boy has an entirely wrong impression of us. Hmm. It's a bit complicated, so listen well. We're in need of your help, huh? Or uh -huh. being ended. What in the uh, world? Why is it so dark? This is very strange. Oh no, oh no! We went too far down! Oh, the sleeping cat! Ah! Oh, yeah. Shh! Don't make a sound! If the sleeping cat wakes, the mainland will be in trouble. for morning. Morning? All right. Uh, Beginning from this moment, we have precisely 30 balls and 300 grains. That's uh, when the next morning comes here. But don't worry, in your world, our day is equivalent to, uh, hmm, let's see. To three minutes. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You understand, Torias? A full day passes here, but you only leave home for three minutes. Hmm. And because of that, our life expectancy has decreased. <laughs> stories that your skin fries if you bask too long in the sunlight of your world. But humans, when exposed to the rays of our sun, become cats. Meow! Hey, Torius, we're cats! <laughs> That's a pretty this decent tail you've got. The kids at school could see us. I'm a cat! <laughs> 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 
We've returned from our mission! Master Sundana, we're back! Where is he? Maybe he went out. Master Sundana! Master Sundana! <coughs> What's that? Huh? Here I am. Huh? No, no, up here. Near the ceiling. <coughs> Master Sundana! <coughs> my word! What happened to you, sir? That balloon is speaking! I'll tell you about it once I get down. Would you be so kind as to pull that rope? <coughs> it was her? The princess? <sighs> Yes, Bulborina paid a visit while you were absent and did this to me. Oh, what a bind. Even if I wasn't a bloated blimp, I wouldn't be able to fix things without my sorcerer's arm. That's his magic glove that Dodo filched. Yes. Say, did you find that owner? It took some time, but, uh... Hey, Torius! Do you mind not calling me that? It's not like you're my friend. Ah, your name is Torius. How good of you to come. I'm sure these fellows gave you quite a shock at first. Please don't be angry with us. It was unavoidable. Did you explain it all to him? We, uh, skipped the details. What are you uh, talking about? But, Nobody but... mentioned squat to me. My sister what? and me were kidnapped, uh, squished into that stupid can, and then we were turned into this. Uh, Change us back! How dare you accuse us of kidnapping? Uh, we asked you to go with us. Yeah, sure you did. Oh, please don't be angry. We desperately need your help. I asked them to bring you here because I want you to catch Papa Doll. What? Papa Doll's here? A fool named Dodo brought him here, and now your pet is wreaking terror on our world. Told you he was here. But there must be a mistake. There's no way my dog would cause such a mess. He's a cowardly good-for-nothing that lays around sleeping all day. Right, Miko? He can lay down. Sleeps all day? Uh, cowardly? Don't blame the poor dog. It's my brother's fault. Papa Doll wasn't like that before. Yeah, well, I've been busy with more important things than taking care of that dumb beast. Master Sonata! Huh? Papa Doll showed up in the town of Hoikoko! He must have come to abduct the residents. Uh, where oh, have you been? Uh, you slow pokes were gone for days. But That's why I said I would go from the very start. Is Dodo with him, Choo Choo? Uh, he's riding atop the monster. <laughs> Unless we have the capsule. Perched like a big ugly bird. Uh, that's our dog? Uh, You're kidding! Torius, uh, look! Look at those spots! Under his eye, the same spots as Papa Doll. Uh, I know those spots anywhere. What are you crazy? We never owned a giant mutant that ran around destroying towns. No one insults Lady Purina, not even my family! Idiot! So anyway, where is Sandana hiding? Dodo! Return the sorcerer's arm at once! You don't even know how to fully use it! You will only bring ruin upon yourself! Wrong! I'll bring ruin upon Bonapur Wit! <laughs> You're a cat gone bad! Hear this! I bring you a message from Lady Buburina. Swear your allegiance to her before the sun rises from the signal tower. Otherwise, great disaster is going to ensue here in Bonapur Wit. Well, Sandana, do you catch my drift? G great disaster? What are you planning uh, to do, Nico. Dodo? Uh, uh, where'd you go? <laughs> You'll uh, see. Ah! Uh, Miko! Get away from him, Papa kid! Doll, Stop! You shouldn't sit on buildings. I was worried about and here you are, making a mess. <laughs> yep, that's him. Miko, don't! He'll eat you! I missed you, Papa Doll. Whoa! Little Miko, look out! Cut it out! That tickle! <laughs> you monster! <laughs> no, Torius, it's Papa Doll! I don't care, come on! 
I've been impatiently waiting for you to return my adorable puppy. <laughs> My, didn't you catch a lot of them today? What a good doggy you are. Yes. She's the... the princess? <laughs> Tomorrow this land of Bonneville Wit will be at your command, my princess. Even that old windbag Sandana can't stand against Papa Doll. They'll soon be crawling here with their tails between their legs. They'd better crawl quickly. <laughs> I will not extend the deadline beyond sunrise. Isn't that right, my Papa Doll? Oh, well, of course you're right. Yes, you're right, my lady. <laughs> He seems tired. You'd better not be rough with him. Uh, never. Hey, do your job. <laughs> if you ever abuse that animal, you will end up like this, too. I, I would never do such a thing. I'm attractive to you, aren't I? Ugh. Then, I'll allow you to kiss my paw. Yeah, b b but princess, I... Uh... Something wrong? You're not afraid of becoming a balloon, uh, are you? Not at all. Or perhaps you don't desire me. No, I mean, yes. <laughs> Enough! Prepare for dawn! Let us go, my Papa Doll! <laughs> How can potent magic of this nature be undone? <sighs> Dodo was lost once he gazed upon it. Was it some kind of spell? Mm hmm. He had been a very studious and diligent pupil of mine. He learned many incantations for the purpose of helping others, but I failed to see the strength of the portrait's witchery, and Dodo fell prey to it. It is said that those who look upon the painting instantly fall in love with Pupurina. Then they devote their lives to fulfilling her every wish. Taste right? I wanted to help him, but that kind of magic isn't easy to undo. I feel dizzy. Shortly thereafter, Dodo stole my invaluable and powerful sorcerer's arm. He then abandoned me to serve Bubulina. You see, Torius, that glove Dodo took is how your dog Papadol was brought to our world. To be honest, I don't believe that Bubulina cast a spell for others to do her bidding simply out of malice. I suspect there's a deeper meaning. If we can discover what it is, perhaps it will change Bubulina. But first, we must find a way to return Papa Doll to normal. Here it comes! Ha! Huh, you better pay closer attention to Master Sandara instead of that thing, or you'll end up like my brother. No way! I sure wouldn't fall for anything like a cat! What do you mean, anything like a cat? Huh? Oh, well, Never mind. the spell doesn't work on outsiders, which is sometimes too bad. Will you give me a break? I am human! Hey, where did they take my sister anyway? Can't somebody do something to get her back? She's in Bulbarina's palace. <laughs> we have to catch Papa Doll so you can return with him to your world before the next sun rises. <laughs> what do you mean? When a creature from another world is touched by our son on their second day here, they become what Papa Doll has become. What? You mean you're gonna... <laughs> <laughs> Were you planning to leave her behind, too? How nice! Then we'll have two monsters to uh, cope with! Uh... Torius, you have to help us! And you're the only one who can save your sister!
Sam. Your beloved huh? Papa doll. You're the only one who doesn't turn into a balloon at my touch. Mm, such soft fur. Mm, and so warm. <laughs> the time is at hand. Time to show them what you can really do. It's something that only can be done by you, a dog. Mm, I know you are a mistreated pet. A beast with a broken heart discarded and forgotten by the humans who owned you. The reason you've grown so much larger since you arrived here isn't just because of the sun, you know. Your heart has been set free and it's become much stronger. Dodo told me that when he first found you, you were alone, lying quite still in the yard. He thought you were dead. But now you have me and I have you, my sweet Papa doll. Mm -hmm. uh. Don't worry. I'm here and you will always be mine forever. Dwells on an ancient faraway island. Wonderful! What a magician! <laughs> now you shall be dazzled by elegant dancing extraordinaire by my lovely daughter Lily Remlom. Ready, love? Yes, I'm ready, Papa. Hmm. <gasps> ah, how marvelous! I've more tricks, Princess. No! I want to see her do some magic! <gasps> but, Princess, my daughter is but a novice in training. Her magic is limited and not yet worth viewing. I wasn't speaking to you! Do something, girl! All right, then. Lily, remember the trick we rehearsed? Yes, Papa. I'll try. Um... Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh, how very cute. <laughs> huh, that was ridiculous. I want to see you cross that rope up there. Uburina, enough, please. You mustn't make her do such a dangerous thing. That rope is Father, old. Father, it is a simple feat. Or is the girl lying about being the daughter of the great magician Remlam? Oh, hmm. no, Lily. Magician, let her do it on her own. Princess, please permit me to help her. The child can't manage by herself. Refused. If you don't follow my orders, neither of you will leave the castle. Whoa. Whoa. Hurry, my 
Daughter! The clumsy girl fell. But it wasn't my fault. Huh. It was a boring performance. Princess Buberina, you took my lily from me. My precious daughter, Buberina, whose every selfish whim is fulfilled. From here on, you will lose what you desire till you understand the sorrow of loss. Whatever and whoever you yearn for will become a trickster's balloon at your touch. Suffer for what you did. Buburina! Buburina! Buburina, I beg you, please don't do this anymore. I know you curse your affliction, but there's reason for everything, my dear. Your mother and I spoiled you by always allowing you to have your own way, and now we are paying for it. It's divine retribution. Shut up! I'm tired of hearing it. If you weren't my parents, I would have popped you long ago. Oh, please, Buberina, no. Let me tell you something. I don't believe that my power is some kind of punishment. Being able to turn things into balloons is just great. Yes. <laughs> Retribution. Oh, wow. I can't believe anyone would turn their own parents into a couple of balloons. It's so mean. Bonneval wit will soon be mine. As usual, I'm going to get everything I want. <laughs> Finished. It's tiny but potent. Oh. Even a gigantic beast like ah. Papadol should sleep for a week. I don't want to wear it. It's a big deal if someone from another world gets hurt here. Let's go! Righto, Master Sandata, we'll go on ahead and meet you. Understood. All right, Torias, when he falls asleep, put the chain on him. Once you put the chain on him, Papa Doll should return to normal. This is his. The one who has lost and forgotten his true self must have bright and pleasant memories to help find and remember himself again. Torias, the only person who can give Papa Doll these memories is you. Uh, and I'm supposed to put this on his collar, right? I have faith in you. We'll follow you shortly. <laughs> assembly to inform you of your fate. Oh, nice job. Thanks. Here is our world. And the great sleeping cat supports our world. You know that, don't you? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh -huh. Now, try to imagine that all of a sudden a huge mouse appears right in front of it. What do you think would happen? Especially if it was an exceptionally lovely mouse. Ah. Ah. Quite obviously, Barnapal Wit would be in deep trouble, wouldn't it? Uh huh, uh huh. Uh huh, uh huh. But then. Woof, 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 woof. Ah. Woof. Woof, woof, woof. Woof, woof. By controlling the sleeping cat, Papa Doll 
Paul will protect Barnapol Wit from possible destruction. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Will you get real? You couldn't even make a mouse that big. The sleeping cat's huge. I've seen him. Besides, Papa Doll would never do that. What? Hey, you're the brat that was petting Papa Doll this morning. You say you were petting my Papa Doll? We raised that dog. He's not yours. Why do you make him do such bad things? He never used to run around being terrible to people and scaring them. Although, Papa Doll has been lazy lately because we hardly ever play with him. But Papa Doll remembered me today and I want him back! Make him the way he was! What is this thing? Hey, you brat! Apologize to Princess Boobarina. She's merciful to little kids, so hurry up and say you're sorry! No way! That witch is the one who turned Papa Doll into such a horrible monster! Princess, what a joke! What? Why yeah. you? How dare you insult me! A princess whose beauty is renowned and who every prince in the land longs for! How could anyone compare me to an ugly witch? For that, you're going to be turned into a balloon and popped! <gasps> what? Mako turned into a balloon? Yeah, they're just like the king, the queen, every prince and member of the royal court. They're all balloons now. But, but Mako can't go home as a balloon. How would I explain that to my mom and dad? Choo Choo, we've got to somehow convince your brother to return that glove. If we get it, we can change Sundata back to normal, right? Hello, Choo Choo? Torius, why do you think Master Sundata's planning to meet up with us? Hey, I'm talking about Miko. Oh, I know she's not your problem, but you're just staring at the moon there, waiting for your prince. What was that? Torius, don't tease her. That moon holds a special meaning. Huh? It's a sad story. About a mouse, a cat, and a love they could never have. It took place long, long ago, at a moment when time stood still. But that's a fairy tale, right? Oh. Cats and mice don't mix. What do you huh? mean, don't mix? Where'd you get that idea? B because cats eat mice where I come from. But we're not in your huh? world now, you fool! Uh. To think! I was actually looking forward to meeting a human, but now I find myself disappointed. Well, pardon me. I'm not here because I want to be, and if the females here are crazy tomboys like you, you can bet I don't want to stay. <gasps> Tomboy, I dare you to say that again. Well, the female cats in my world are like the ones here, stuck up and short-tempered. For a pet, I'll take a dog any day. <laughs> Boomerina's castle! There it is! Huh? Huh? <sighs> Torius, we're here. Great. Uh, what's wrong? Why won't this little punk turn into a balloon? Uh, well, uh, that's, that's because... Don't uh, uh, off me! I'm human, okay? Huh. Well, then. When the rays of tomorrow's sun fall upon you, you'll be just like Papa Doll. Um, I think I'm going to make you my new pet. No! I'm not listening to a word you say! <gasps> I can't wait for tomorrow! Dodo! Let's begin! <laughs> <laughs> Sleeping cat ought to be pleased with this. Yes. Now, Dodo, the most important thing is the control. You have to approach it and then get away quickly. Control it well. But of course, this is all for nothing if Bonneville Wit collapses. <laughs> Ouch! Watch where you're going. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh oh. Energy, we only have about 300 grains left before sunrise. All right, if this works, I'll send a signal. Let's go! Huh? 
You have got to get it into Papa Doll's mouth. Are you sure this is going to work? I don't have a good feeling about this. Just do one thing for me, okay? Keep a firm grasp. Ah! Oh my gosh, the rope's tangled. <laughs> My chamber! Ah, she swallowed it! Guards! Guards! Intruder! Oh no! Why, oh, Your Majesty? Now, boy, look into my eyes! Aren't they the most beautiful eyes in the world? <laughs> I don't think so. 
My, my, long time no see, Dodo. Shut up! I'm sick of you getting in the way of me and my princess. But don't you realize we're worried about you? Worried? Are you kidding me? I would do anything for Lady Buberina. Nothing can change the way I feel about her! <laughs> <laughs> that ought to keep you out of my fur. Dodo! <laughs> Dodo! Uh, uh, Are you all right, Mr. Shinoboke? I'm fine. I'm coming to rescue you. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, 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 doll without the capsule. Hey. Huh? You piggybacked me the whole way? You were hypnotized. You could have awakened me, you know. There wasn't time for that. We were about to be the main course. I must have been heavy. Huh? Nothing. Forget it. Hey, you two! How long are you gonna stay up there? Get down here right now! The sun is about to come up! Uh, lady Wolverine... Uh, when you're asleep, you look so irresistible. <laughs> Princess. Dodo! Yes, ma'am. What's that dreadful racket? Look, over there! Huh? Come on, Mr. Sudabuki! Yeah! Yeah! The dome's opening! Who's doing it? Lady Puburina! What's going on? No, no, no! A hundred grains till sunrise! A hundred grains? Then we have to rush into the castle and find Papa Doll. Uh, um, yeah. <laughs> Thieves, <laughs> get down from there! No, no, don't let them escape! Here, Papa Doll, come on, boy! Ah! Ah! Get out of my way! It's Dodo! Hurry, make a run! <laughs> You'll both be a snack for the sleeping cat! Yay! There's only 70 grains left! Try again. Whoa. Ready? Go! Uh, uh, me too! Uh, me too! Uh, oh, don't you know how to land? Uh, you keep forgetting that I'm not a cat. There you are! Uh, <laughs> 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 
momentarily you'll become a balloon and then you'll pop! <laughs> uh, more foreigners! Oh no, the clouds are already out! Oh, 52 grains! This doesn't bode well. There isn't much time. Hurry up! Oh dear me! Oh my my! You can catch me! <laughs> oh, you're just begging for it, aren't you? No, no! <laughs> Smells like him. Hey, Papa Doll, not like that. You gotta focus the light. Oh, Pete, it really is you. Contact with any little green spacemen yet? <laughs> come on, let's go. I want to get over to the video arcade, all right? We'd ask you to come along too, Torias, but you're busy. Hunting UFOs with your dumb mutt as usual, right? Yeah, that's <laughs> right. What a geek. <laughs> Jimbei, don't bother with him. Come on, guys, let's go. Hey, did you know the arcade got a new game in? Yeah, it's totally cool, but that thing's super uh, fast. I can't keep uh, pace with it. Man, Toru, how do you get away with all this with your hands? Uh, Uh-huh. <laughs> 
Torius! Only 40 grains left! It almost looks as if he's in a trance! Yeah, yeah. Huh? I understand, Papa Doll. I don't have any right to take you back, do I? The one who has lost and forgotten his true self must have bright and pleasant memories to help find and remember himself again. Torias, the only person who can give Papa Doll these memories is you. Papa Doll? Uh. Uh. Yeah! Uh. Soup! Oh! With whom? I share the blood! Uh. I know exactly what you're up to, you cut! I've been rocked and I will not let you take away Papa Doll! Uh. Try this one! dark out here. Come closer, Papa Doll. Up. Do you see how many stars are up in the sky, Papa Doll? There has to be an alien race out there. Come on! You have to point the light up for this to work. You flash it twice and then put it back this way. Here, watch. That's better. Space! You know, boy, if a UFO ever does land, you'll have to be on your best behavior. Don't scare them away by barking. Maybe they'll let us on board their spacecraft. I'd get on in a second. You should come with me too, of course. You got that, Papa Doll? Don't worry, boy. I'll make sure that they won't do any experiments on you. In fact, I'm gonna write it on your collar. Ya, Su, O, with whom I share the blood of my canine friend allows no mutilation. Look, Papa Doll, it's a UFO! What's wrong with you? I'm your owner, Papa Doll! Torius! Uh, uh, ah! Papa Doll, you're the dog.
monsters! Arr, this is bad! At this rate, we'll end up with three monsters! Uh, only uh? 19 grades left! Okay, we're gonna try to go straight now! That's it? I'll ram them! Princess! Opinion. 
Well, excuse me. If you ever want to be a cat again, Torias, come back anytime. That's right. There's no such thing as boredom here in Bonnepal Wit. Careful what you say. I couldn't survive something like this once more. I'll bet that lousy Booberina will be up to no good again for sure. Why doesn't she just go away? Nico, huh? Master Sandata was once saying that the reason the princess is bad is because she only wants. She never appreciated the meaning of giving. Hmm. I'll buy that, but I wonder why she didn't turn Dodo into a balloon. Who knows? Well, maybe it's because the princess fell in love with the guy. What? I'm sure she'll calm down a lot after this ordeal. Oh, and by the way, you're almost home. <laughs> Well, I guess this is goodbye for now, little Miko. If you come pick me up, we can <laughs> see each other whenever we want. Hey, no fair, Torias. You got to shake hands. Me too, me too. Sheesh, it's no big deal. I want to tell too. I want to tell. <laughs> choo choo. Miko! Hurry now or I'll leave without you! <laughs> Morning, you rascal. Hey, did you have a good breakfast? You're gonna need your energy. I'm taking you on a walk after school, okay, Papa Doll? Wait for me, <laughs> Torias! You're gonna be late. Uh, don't smack me! What's with you? How come you're wired up all of a sudden? Torias, you'd better wait for me! I'm gonna tell Mom about this, you jerk! Torius, wake up! Torius. We've got trouble! Uh, darn. Little Miko's not huh? here either. Yes, you are. Are you still here? Huh? Get to school already. You're going to be late again. Ah! Get to school! school. Oh, no. 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 Oh,